presence. My name is Matt Keith. I'm a technical instructor at the Memphis, Tennessee location. I've been a certified computer instructor since 1998. I've also been a computer repair technician, a network technician, network administrator, project manager, and an IT director. I've taken many exams over the years, and I hope today to give you five tips to help you pass your next exam. Tip number one, take a class at New Horizons. We're easy to find. You can find us in the phone book or online. Be happy to register you for a course today. Tip number two would be to read all of the course material. Often there's additional information that may be not covered in your class. This may be a digital book, maybe a physical book, has tips on taking exams, even information on future. Tip number three, lab work. Most of our courses offer some type of lab work to get you hands-on practice on information that's going to be covered in your exam. Currently, we offer you six months to work on, so you can do this repeatedly until you feel comfortable. Tip number four, using flashcards. I recommend starting out with about 100 flashcards. Once you get about halfway to your uh, exam date, you want to be able to narrow that down to 50. A few days before your exam, get this narrowed down to about 20 cards. Then about a day to go, you probably will introduce about five cards from the previous 100 that you thought you had, but maybe gotten a, a little less comfortable feeling confident that you understand that material and you want to bring these back in and I would take that information with me right up till I walk in to take my exam. Review that a few minutes before you'll feel a lot more comfortable. Tip number five, practice exams. It's probably included with the course. Contact your account executive and see. But what you want to be able to do is consistently get to 90 even 95 percent be able to take this exam a couple of times, get 90, 95 consistently, and you're ready to go. Good luck with your exam, and I hope to see you in class this future.